which one should I learn either DevOps or uh, automation testing? Should I choose a Selenium automation testing or DevOps or AWS DevOps? So this question has been asking for many candidates. I'm going to clear your doubts in this session. So watch till the end of video. Then you definitely choose one best career option with yourself only. So my name is Lakshman and welcome back to another video. So before going to discuss about main topic, if you have visited our YouTube channel for the first time, then don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel and also don't forget to share to your network and to share to your friends as well. Okay, so without wasting our time, let us start the main topic, which is the best career option, either DevOps or Selenium automation testing. See friends, I will differentiate a few points related to these both technologies, then you can finalize yourself only. So which technology shoots to your profile? So based on your skills, based on your education qualification, you have to choose the, you have to choose the technology. Okay, first let me clearly explain what is a Selenium automation testing and what is a DevOps. Selenium is a UI testing framework, user interface testing framework to test the web applications or web apps. So to do automation testing and, and to write automation test scripts, we have to use one programming language along with the Selenium concept to automate any website. You have to notice one important point here. You should be have good knowledge on any one programming language along with the Selenium concepts to write automation test scripts to test the web applications. Because without programming language, you may not write any test cases or any test scripts to automate the uh, web applications. Okay. So it might be Java programming language or Python or C sharp or JavaScript or PEL, any one programming language is required to write automation test scripts. Therefore, I highly recommend you, if you are good in programming or coding knowledge, then better to choose Selenium, then better to choose Selenium automation testing career option. Then you may have doubt what are the uh, additional skills also required along with the Selenium and any one programming language. So you must have some additional skills, so BDD framework like uh, JBehave, or Cucumber and also you must have skills like uh, test ng framework and API testing skills like uh, rest assured and performance testing skills like uh, uh, JMeter okay any mobile application testing skills like this there are a number of additional skills also uh, required to become a good automation test engineer in IT industry nowadays so along with these skills uh, you must have some uh, manual testing concept knowledge as well like oh, um, black box testing, white box testing, okay, uh, bug life cycle, STLC, boundary value analysis, uh, RTM, matrices, okay. So you must have sound knowledge on, on these concepts as well. Now we will discuss about DevOps. So DevOps engineer make sure that the time to deployment is reduced and the code quality is maintained by implementing CI and CD, continuous integration and continuous deployment. That means you have to implement the project in the process of like uh, you have to create the automatic uh, automatic build process and uh, automatic testing and automatic security analysis and automatic delivery and uh, automatic deployment as well. Everything will happen automatic only. That is the use of uh, DevOps concept. In case if you are learning AWS DevOps, then it is highly recommended job nowadays. It is one of the most demand job. Uh, if you have good, if you have sound knowledge on AWS cloud service provider along with uh, DevOps concept. But to become a DevOps engineer, you must have a multi, multi skills candidate. Like you should have sound knowledge on different tools like uh, Git and GitHub and uh, any cloud service provider like AWS, Azure or uh, uh, GCP. And along with that, you must have um, uh, Kubernetes uh, tool experience and Ansible experience and Docker experience. And also you should have knowledge on any uh, scripting as well, like a uh, shell scripting or Python or anyone. Okay, along with that, you must have some monitoring tools experience, okay, and some security related uh, tools experience as well. So anyhow, to become a DevOps engineer, you should have learned uh, more than five tools or six tools. To become a good DevOps engineer, you must have, you should have sound knowledge on different uh, tool set. Then you may have doubt, is there any coding or programming is required to become a DevOps engineer means uh, uh, yes, some minimum coding is required to become a DevOps engineer. It is, it is also based on the project. 
based on the client requirement you must utilize the your coding knowledge but anyhow you must have strong knowledge on scripting it might be shell scripting or uh, bash scripting or any python to automate the task whenever it is required in the project so therefore whenever you are facing any interview as a devops engineer you must be prepared before attending any interview any scripting experience is required you must prepare some commands related to to do automation task whenever it is required now you can decide yourself i can say both technologies are more demand in it industry nowadays you can go or uh, automation testing it is also very uh, huge job openings are there and uh, for aws devops also there are huge uh, demand is there in it market but which one should i choose so if you are very good in uh, coding then better to choose automation testing okay so once you become automation test engineer in the future you, you can also upgrade your skills by learning devops uh, tools and you can become devops engineer also in the future okay so if you if you start your career as a devops engineer you may not uh, switch to uh, uh, again in automation testing yes there is opportunity is there there is a chance is there you can switch if you want but but many of the candidates they may not switch again into automation testing or technology if you started as a devops engineer so so you can decide yourself if you are very good in coding then better to choose automation testing career option if you are uh, if you have some minimum coding knowledge then better to choose aws devops option but my recommendation is go with aws devops only okay because AWS cloud service provider technology is most demand in the future as well. I hope you cleared your doubt which technology should I choose. Okay. So, so it is up to you guys. So that's all guys mine. So if you feel this video is very informative, then don't forget to hit the like button and also don't forget to share to your friends as well. Okay. So we'll meet with one more useful content video. Thank you very much.